so today I don't know why I'm so excited today but it's so beautiful outside and it's fall and it's getting cooler out and I just love this type of weather but today I have a video for you about my hair and I made this wig this wig well this hair is from hair are us and y'all y'all know I love some like a good curly hair so I got four this is eight I got four bundles of all natural the all natural collection they have Brazilian curly and I got four bundles of 20 inches and it, you bet I did put all four bundles in my head so y'all know I love like some super big hair so this is what four bundles looks like it's big and I just love it especially during the colder cooler seasons because you know you're outside and you get chilly and you have all this hair to just keep you nice and warm so the hair came packaged so cutely um as you can see right here it came in this baggie and it just says hair are us i was about to say so it's h a u which stands for hair are us extensions i just realized that wow um, number one, Trusted Human Hair, and it has a website, and on the back it has a little logo. I thought this was so cute. I love this. So, it's white and pink, my favorite. So, uh, yeah, so I got four bundles of 20 inches. I'm going to show you guys a clip of how I wash the hair. So, as you know, when you get your hair, you should always, always, always co-wash it. And I just like also co-washing it because it makes the curls like pop. Um, it looks more natural to me to install it after you wash it. So yeah, so I'm going to show you guys in a clip of what I use to wash my hair. So when I wash my hair, um, I use the Maui Moisture Vanilla Bean Conditioner. And I just wash each bundle separately and then rinse the hair, rinse the water off of the hair. And then I let them air dry. I did put um, leave-in conditioner in, which I ran out and I threw away. But it was like a spray leave-in conditioner um, just so the hair could be moisturized. Because when you have curly hair, it's very important to moisturize it. So uh, after I put the leave-in conditioner, I made sure I used my dimmin brush to define the curls and make sure it's not tangled or anything which it wasn't and then I let the hair air dry so after the hair air dry I made it into a wig and I use the flip over method if y'all see my videos before whenever I make wigs I always use the flip over method um I used to do like a U part but I just love the flip over method best because you can just leave a tiny bit of your hair on the front and just plop it over and it's just easier for me and everything so I have an old video um I'll link it below of me showing y'all how I do that but I love the flip over method and that's what I did to achieve this look so a little bit of my hair was left out so after I made my wig um as you know when you're making a wig you're like kind of like combing the hair out with your fingers because you have to weft it so I went and washed it again um, just so all the curls can be like, you know, not humongous. So I did use this silicone mix this time. Um, and I hope y'all can see that. I use this and I used to use this all the time on my weaves, y'all. I forgot all about this. I don't know what made me think to get it and use it again, but I literally hardly have any left i got it at the beauty supply store i think they have it at target too it's cheaper at target um beauty supply store it was 7.99 for eight ounces and it's like almost gone i did wash more hair with this um that's why there's not that much left but yeah so i put the silicone mix on this hair and let it sit for like a good 30 minutes so it can deeply penetrate the hair and i knew this hair was super super curly and i wanted it to retain moisture and look very very healthy so i highly recommend getting silicone mix conditioner when you're washing your hair or if you want to revive your hair um and i like the way it smells like i don't i think some people don't like it but 
I love the way it smells and it, it just smells like this for days it smells so good to me but yeah so I did that and voila I have this style so to style my hair I have two methods um, that I do to blend my natural hair with extensions so the quick and easy method is well actually they're both kind of no one is longer because you get to wear it overnight so one method is um using a curling wand and oh, i use this curling wand for new me y'all probably seen it multiple 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 times but i love this curling wand this is like the smallest thinnest curling wand i've ever seen and it goes perfectly for its small tight ringlets um or kinky curly hair um i think this is a eight millimeter I had it for so long it's like coming off but it's from new me so what I did to achieve this look was I just took my hair and a piece of the um, weave and just blended it together well put it together and curl wanted it both together and it came out like this I will have a tutorial a quick IG tutorial on how I blend my hair and styled it coming soon but yeah, you guys, this is great if you're on the go and need to put some wand curls in your hair that match your wig or weave, you know. And the other method I like to use are these perm rods. So this is my like go-to, go-to method because um, I do not like putting heat on my hair. The only time I really use this curling wand is like if I'm about to go somewhere. I didn't know I was about to go somewhere, so I couldn't put these in overnight um or like if i'm going out out and i just want that like sleek bomb you know look i'll use this but like for work you know on everyday basis i'll put these in my hair at night so um if you have like a sew-in or something you can just put your hair in a piece of this hair and put it together so it blends in the morning or you can just take the wig off at night and put these on in your leave out area what is that noise outside okay it was just a plane sorry but yeah so I love these for um, blending without using heat which works great and then even though my hair was air dried when I did put my wig on um, I like to use this um, blow dryer and oh one second so even though I do let my hair air dry, I still like to use my blow dryer and diffuser. So I'll just take like a spray bottle and mist this water throughout my hair and then use this just to give it like extra body and volume. And y'all, when I wear curly hair, I do not like the uniformed pattern look. So that's why I also use the diffuser to like give it some more volume and make it look a little more natural so I will like go through and do this to it use the blow dryer pick it out whatever however big I want to make it this hair can definitely get bigger as y'all can see and one more thing I love using this Maui Moisture Vanilla Bean Hair Butter on the hair for a leave-in conditioner it smells so good if y'all love vanilla this you need to get this like it just smells so good and it's so moisturizing it's great for curly hair I even use it on my natural hair like I love this stuff so so much and that's why I have the conditioner too and a shampoo I have everything for it but it works well and it has aloe vera in it um, and that's like one of the first ingredients I believe yeah aloe vera so I usually use products that have aloe vera aloe vera as the first ingredient because it's super more moisturizing especially for curly hair so yeah you guys this hair is a bomb um when i did wash it i didn't get any like dye coming out now if you get dye coming out of your virgin you know 100 percent virgin hair it's not virgin because that means they dyed it and they processed it before so this hair had zero dye nothing came out of it it was so easy to just like comb through it to wash it to detangle it which it really wasn't detangled it really wasn't tangled anyway but um also another tip do not do not try to detangle your hair 
while it's dry, especially curly hair. Now, you know, curly hair is going to tangle because the curls are going to interlock. Like, that's just a given. Like, natural curly hair tangles, wefted hair tangles, wig curly hair tangles. So you just have to make sure that you spray it with water or wet it, saturate it, conditioner, and then detangle the hair. It will work much easier. You won't have hair fallout and all that crazy stuff. So yeah, just make sure you do that. Um, overall, I am loving this hair. This is going to be my new fall, winter curly hair. So if y'all see me on IG, and you like my hair just know that it's this one I'll make sure I tag them in it so y'all can see but this hair is so beautiful like it's amazing I have zero issues with it at all um, I'm gonna turn around so you can see the back of it you can see how full it is so here's the back of the hair and like I said it is a lot a lot of hair but it is so gorgeous and big so yeah, you guys, so that is all. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please make sure you check out Hair Are Us. Like I said, this is the all natural collection and it is the Brazilian Curly, four bundles of 20 inches. And it is bomb, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you have any questions or comments, let me know. And thank you for watching. Bye-bye.